Hi folks, my name is Hermit in the Forest and this is my unboxing of Secret of the Silver Blades. This is classic role playing game from SSI, uh, the gold box range. It is a sequel to Pool of Radiance and Curse of the Azure Bonds. Uh, the story of this game uh, tells us about two brothers, one of them being a paladin, the other being a mage, and the mage turned evil, researched necromancy and uh, uh, became a lich eventually, called Dreadlord. So the brothers fought, but the paladin didn't want to kill his brother, and so he froze him together with his castle and with an entire village under that castle uh, with the help of uh, some group called the Silver Blades and now when the adventurers arrive uh, when your party arrives uh, the uh, frost uh, the ice begins to melt and there is danger that the lich reawakens again so you have to stop him. Again, uh, you have a party of up to six adventurers. Uh, there's a combination of uh, first-person 3D view while exploring and ice, uh, or top-down view when you encounter some enemies and this is used for combat. So let's take a look at the box art. Yum. Now let's turn the box around and see some info about the game and pictures from the game. Yeah, it's from the Forgotten Realms setting. So you can meet some famous characters here, I think, Elminster, or maybe another game, but probably you can meet him even here. Well, now let's open the box and see what's inside. Of course, the game itself. On five and quarter inches discs, there are two. Disc one and disc two. Then there is registration card. Good. It's here. Some advertisement. Another advertisement for Dragon Strike. Okay, and here is the SSI catalog uh, where they offered a lot of their role playing games of the 90s. Yeah, Curse of the Other Bones here, Dragons of Flame, and others. Now, here's the reference card. Basic tips about installing the game and playing the game. Here are the controls and it's also on the other side. Joystick controls, copy protection and such. Now, what's next? Here's the rule book. Take a look at the table of contents. Of course, it's based on advanced Dungeons and Dragons rules, like all gold box range SSI games. What this game box should contain, contain it has everything. Yeah, you could transfer your party from the previous game in the series. The rule book is pretty thin, has only a few pages.
basic info about playing the game. Well, that's the rule book. Now we have here Adventurer's Journal. That's the last thing in the package. And that is pretty thick, thick book. Take a look at the table of contents again. Yeah, this is about the rules, mostly, yeah, AD and D rules, and here's some maps. Here's the story for the start. Yeah, character classes, you can see attributes. So everything, everything about AD and D rules, alignment, yeah. People familiar with AD and D don't have to read this really. Although of course this is based on the older rules than the current. And nice pictures in here, I see. Very nice pictures. I like it. I like it very much. Some enemies. Oh, here's the Mastodon. I never saw it in any game. Such an enemy. The old age elephant. Yeah, here's the spells and now at the end there's some journal entry, journal entries, a lot of them, possibly what happened, enhances the story. Some maps. And here are some tables, experience tables. Again, AD and D based. And here's the credits. SSI Special Projects Group was the developer of this game. Well, and that is all that was in the box. I thank you very much for watching this video.